Facing off against State Treasurer Kimberly Yee in her reelection race is Democrat Martin Quesada, currently a 10 year veteran of the state legislature. He's now termed out of the state Senate and looking to make a move to become Arizona's top banker. ABC 15's Amelia Fabiano sitting down with him to find out his goals in office if he unseats Yee. We are all native uh, Phoenicians. Um, my mother immigrated to this country from a small mining town called uh, Cananea, Mexico. The oldest of four, Democratic Senator Martin Quezada, credits his and his siblings' dedication to public service to their parents. My parents set kind of an example, just how to, how to live um, and how to be there. They were, they were strong Catholics, you know, growing up. And so they really served their community. They served others. Um, uh, and we kind of adopted that kind of mentality, that perspective. He was a first generation college student attending both Glendale Community College and ASU. He tells me his higher education pathway was a difficult one. It's given me the experience that a lot of individuals here are facing right now. I've struggled. I've struggled to keep the lights on. I've struggled to put food on the table. I've struggled to uh, go to work and go to school at the same time. He interned at the state capitol, then became an attorney, eventually finding himself serving in the state legislature. And now you're trying to make the switch from the Senate to treasurer. Yes. Why? What I realized after serving for 10 years is that um, a lot of those issues, a lot of those things that I've cared a lot about, you know, funding public education, you know, health care as a human right, you know, uh, uh, putting justice into our criminal justice system, protecting our planet, our air, our water, all of those issues, you needed money really to advance those issues. His top issues, he says he wants to tackle and invest in more if he wins the seat, public education, the environment, and the housing crisis. I mean, housing is a financial issue. Uh, you know, being able to pay rent uh, or, or address the, the rising rent prices every single day, that has a, an impact on people's personal finances. Uh, and that has an impact on our state's finances if people are losing their homes. The state of our economy and rising inflation, he says, weighing heavy on this position next term. I expect to treat every dollar uh, as a state treasurer in the way that I've been treating those dollars and that every Arizona, most Arizonans are treating those dollars every, uh, every day as well. They, they don't have a dollar to, to, to waste. They don't have a dollar to lose. While Quesada said challenging the Republican incumbent will be difficult, he believes Arizona deserves a change in the treasurer's office. I'm going to do things differently because I'm going to put the responsible management and investment of the people's money first. I'm going to keep the politics and, and the, the extreme politics out of those decisions. Amelia Fabiano, ABC 15, Arizona.